Right. Um, I made some changes. Or do I need to dress Shale again? Uh, with, 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 with. We have Brilliant Spirit Crystal. So we're gonna go and look for Stian's yes. sword. Yes. Yes. Indeed. Um, uh, Frostback Mountain Mountains. Uh, I'm sure that it said Farin was. Headed to Orsamar. I'm sure I spoke to him, but maybe it was uh, during one of these crashes and. Um, There we go, Berserker. Um, perfect striking. Could be cool. Oh, you have one more. I am ready. Yes. Um, perfect strike. And then we have Liliana. And you need 20 strengths for the boots I want to give you. Softer right now, but that's because I have people sleeping. People I live with. Like kids and husband. So far and there we go. I was sure I already talked to him and he sent me back to and he sent me back to um Redcliffe, but I've told you what I can, I swear to you. I'd like to see your wares. Oh, uh, certainly. <sighs> so, did, um, did this bug out now? Canary Commander Plate. Hmm. Uh, oh, yes. I'd like this. Do we have the whole set? 
Canary Commander. Can we sort by name? stuff. Uh, so, Kunari Commander, Knight Commander, Restriction Templar, Kunari Sword, hmm. <laughs> No, okay. Dispel grenade. Hmm. Okay. Actually, this, the dispel grenade could be good if somebody is not magical like me and Alistair needs to dispel something. Um, so, no I'm worried that this quest is bugged out. Yeah. And what else did we have? Um, Lake Callan had. So... I'm just gonna do these three things. I'm gonna do this, this, and, and this. That's what I'm gonna do. And then we're gonna go to, probably go back here, but. <laughs> so let's travel to Lake Callanhead. This way, I hope. <laughs> what do you want from me? Oh, uh, hello. You have coins, stranger? With Orzammar closed off, old Tegrin can give you a discount. It's not Fine weapon and arms, dwarven made. Yes, yes. Times has changed in Orzammar, but let's see that discount. Oh, that was nice. Um, Canary Commander boots. anything from you. That would be so cool though, wouldn't it? To give Stan all the Canary stuff. So, I have no hmm. idea. I spy, with my little eye, something that begins with G. <sighs> Is it a Grey Warden? Is it in fact you? Oh, you're really good at this. <sighs> <laughs> Oh god. Um, yeah, so I have forgotten um, how to do this quest with Elgrin. By the way, I think I need him in my party. Vashadan! Maybe. Uh. The Mage's Collective thanks you. Make us smile upon you. Alright. Anything else? Good to see you again. Can I get you a <clears throat> There she is. I'm going to go talk to her. Look, you got to back me up here. Got it? What do you mean, back you up? Just uh, follow my lead, you know? Oh, 
God, let me talk to her first. She might be married now. Hey, hadn't thought of that. Hm. Find out how much she misses old Ogren or who I have to kill, and then I'll go sweep her off her feet. That's me, <laughs> Mr. Charm. <laughs> yeah, this is not gonna end well because I don't know how to do this. It was Felsi, right? Lorana? Um, Felsi. Right, so Lorana has a quest for me, has she? What can I get for you? And don't say mead. We ran out of that a week ago. And don't say rum, either. Ran out the day before yesterday. And don't say brandy. <laughs> Why all the liquor shortage? Have you seen how desperate people are now? They just want a drink to forget what's happened. Some ran out of coin and started paying in food, chickens, whatever they had. Felsi! I need tables clean, girl! I've got a customer! Your name's Felsi? Aye, who wants to know? I'm a friend of Ogren's. And you admit it? You don't smell drunk. Get kicked in the head by a Bronto, did you? <laughs> He's a changed man. Oh? What's he changed into then? A horn toad? Felsi, <laughs> what in Andraste's name are you doing? The tables, girl! All right! I've got to get back to work. <laughs> oh, I think I missed this. Can I talk to her again? I got work to do. I don't need to think about that sodding waste. Oh, shit. Well, what does she say? She's standing right there. Go get her. Just be ready to pry her off when she throws herself at me. We don't want to make a scene here. Well... Don't pry her off me too soon. I mean, a little scene's all right. Oh, Are you so sure so... you're not a baker? Because you got a sodding nice set of buns. Oh, please. Well, look what the nug dragged in. I should have known you were in the neighborhood by the stench. What are you doing here? Uh, just trying to kick back with a pint. Fighting Darkspawn's a lot of sodding work, you know? You're fighting Darkspawn? Um... <laughs> Just watch. I don't know. Maybe I should bat in. This man took on an army of golems almost single-handed. It was a bit of pain, but it was a personal favor for the King of Orzammar, you understand? <laughs> the whole surface to choose from, and you just happened to come to my tavern? Eh, uh, well... Uh... Whisper to Ogren, tell her it's fate. <laughs> he was looking for you, actually. You know, I was thinking about our days together back in Orzammar. <laughs> oh, so you mean you didn't find another girl willing to put up with you pissing on the table? I'm shocked. It's a sign of affection. Whisper to Ogren, tell her you've been thinking of her. I've been thinking about you, Felsi. What do you want, Ogren? Nothing. Just thought I'd see how you were doing is all. Well, maybe that and grease up the Bronto, if you know what I mean. <laughs> God, well, disgusting. you've seen me. You'll have to go back to Orzammar for the Bronto. <laughs> oh, God. Lie, we can't waste time here. The Queen's waiting for us. No, I don't want to do that. I'm just going to go. Admit it. Ogren is much more fun than the men around here. If by fun you mean more likely to light farts on fire, yes. <laughs> oh well, it's been fun, Felsi, but I better go. Don't let the door hit you in the arse on the way out. Actually, who am I kidding? Go ahead and let it. Indulge yourself. Oh god. <laughs> okay, that didn't go as planned. That bridge is burned. Yes. So what do you want then, Lorana? Yes. Oh yeah, I'm sorry to tell you that your husband is dead. Oh, would someone like to handle this for me? 
So, you know that husband of yours? <laughs> oh, no. Dead. Sorry. No, I can't believe this. I won't. Yeah, I was kind of hoping for Alistair or Liliana. Oh, the innkeeper has something to say to me. Welcome back to the Spoiled Princess. How may I serve you today? Um, I'd like a drink. Of course. What would you like? I don't get it. He had a question mark, or he had like a return request. Saying nothing here, right? No. Bye. Okay. Um, let's bounce over to the. Um, Circle of Magi. Welcome back, youngster. Looking to go across to the tower? Yes, please. Off we go then. In war, victory, in peace, vigilance, in death, sacrifice. Uh, right, let's talk to Irving. You went above and beyond the call of duty for the Circle. You have done us proud. Uh, Diagna of Orzammar wishes to study magic. Orzammar? Indeed. <laughs> you have piqued my curiosity. It is common knowledge that dwarves lack the aptitude for spellcraft. She will never be able to weave the simplest magic, no matter how hard she tries. Um, all she wants is to study the theory of magic. Fascinating. <laughs> I suppose the circle should be flattered. Um, she's dreamed about it all her life. Don't disappoint her. I cannot deny anyone, dwarf or human, the chance to learn. Knowledge should not be withheld from those who seek it. Tell Dagna of Orzimar that this path will not be easy. But if she chooses it, then she is welcome here at the Circle. She will live and study with the Tranquil, and perhaps the apprentices, when it is appropriate. She's going to be so overjoyed. Ah, if only the circle was in better shape. I fear she may be disappointed when she arrives. Hmm. I think she'll be very interested in what happened. This will be interesting. <laughs> she could tell us much about our dwarven neighbors. Yes, the more I think about it, the more I like the idea. I shall take this as an indication that perhaps things are starting to look up for the circle. <laughs> Thank you. Is there anything else I can do for you? You've already done much for the circle. Now, you must see to your duty as a Grey Warden. Forgive me, but I must take my leave. I wish you well. Know you will always be welcome here. Alright, so I need to go back to Dagna. You really killed all those abominations? I didn't think it was possible. I thought we'd all die here. I'm sure you need supplies after that, don't you? <laughs> All right. Um, what do you have? Mm, a lot of lyrium dust. So do I.
I can sell you this crap, can't I? Alright. Let's get out of this creepy, creepy, creepy place. And now, uh, let's go back to Ozma. I'm an errand boy. I have like, I don't know, I have no role playing reason for why. Hello, how can I? Oh, it's you! And it's been, well, quite a while. Enough time to get to the circle and back, I hope. Oh, please tell me what they said. <laughs> She's so cute. I love her voice actor. Uh, yes. Um, first enchanter Irving accepted you for study. Ancestors, bless you. I can't believe it. There hasn't even been a dwarven observer in the circle since you're relevant in the 13th century. Uh, I, I, I need to pack. No, my parents would get suspicious. I need to go. Is there anything I should bring? Books? Tuition? Uh, nothing. The mages need every ally, ally they can get. Then I should go before my parents come looking for me. If you ever go to the circle again, maybe I'll see you there. <laughs> Our parents are gonna be so angry with me. Alright, I think that's it. Let's run out of here. Listen to some banter and then off to Redcliffe. So, you and Branca were really married? Tell you what, boy. <laughs> You ever been married? Of course not. I was raised in the Chantry. Think the hardest stone you can find. Marriage is for suckers. So, no pitter-patter of little Ogwen feet running around the home cave, I take it? All I ever got out of that moss liquor was a headache, a deaf ear, a scratched up back, and that rash it took three different ointments to get rid of. Wow. She gave up on you, did she? And here you are, a keeper too. Ah, oh, be nice to Ogren. He's a uh, disgusting bugger, but... Okay. Okay. And... Cliff. They really hate me, unless it's a shop again, and it is. I don't want to talk to you. Gather your party and venture forth? No. Move along, friend. Yes, yes. Um, oh. Thank you. Oh, wait. Knight Commander Harris. Handler room purchase to Knight Commander Harris on behalf of the Majors. If Majors giving personal gifts to Templars doesn't seem room, you can go to Knight Commander Tavish in Denerim and testify about the bribe with the Lurium potions as evidence. No, I'm not going to do that. I want my Lurium potions. <laughs> it's not really that super important, but. I decided I'm not going to do it. And 
now what we're doing is we're lo looking for Stan's sword. Thunder Humper. Yes. Thunder Humper. Why are you here? What do you mean? Women are priests, or merchants, or artisans, or farmers. None of those have any place fighting. I have no idea how to answer this. It is not done. There is no more to it. Do you mean your people have no female mages or warriors? Of course not. Why would our women wish to be men? What are you talking about? They don't wish to be men. They shouldn't. That can only lead to frustration. Stan! No, never mind. Let's drop this. <laughs> The deep dark before dawn's first light seems eternal, yes, yes. but know that the sun always rises. The Irregulars thank you. Okay. Um, yes. Okay. All right, all right. Okay. So let's see how this goes then. Go celebrate or whatever you have to do. I look you for the canary sword you brought. Now why would you be interested in that? It's mine. <sighs> you know, Farron didn't mention the giant he took it from was alive. Why don't you give up the sword and we'll go? Excellent idea. It's in my strong box. Here's the key. Now, why don't you leave me alone? Okay. Key. Got it. Stand sword. You can keep the rest. Bye. Go celebrate or whatever you have to do. Um I could use your help with the dark spawn. If I wanted to fight Darkspawn, I'd have stayed in Orzammar. No thanks. Thank you for helping with the battle. Hey, anything for Redcliffe, right? Whatever. First thing I'm gonna do is get some sleep. For about a week. Go celebrate or whatever it is you're gonna do. You won, right? You're a hero. Or something. Okay. No. Uh, we shall give this sword to Stan because he saw that I got it. I'm not going to wait until I get back to camp. Where is it? There. Strange. I had almost forgotten it. Completion. Are you sure you are a Grey Warden? I think you must be an Ashkari to find a single lost blade in a country at war. You're welcome, Stan. I would thank you for this, if I knew how. And I could deliver a much more satisfying answer to the Arishok's question if the blight were ended, don't you agree? Absolutely. Then lead the way. Ah, oh, that's nice. So now he's 74. Yay! And... Yeah. His sword and his honor restored. Stan chose to continue with Dalen and take the battle to the Archdemon. Fabulous. Horror awaits those who perish outside of the Maker's forgiveness! <laughs> Items received. Oh. I should give this to Stan, shouldn't I? Yes, I should. I should totally give this to Stan. So I need to go back to camp and we need to go back to camp and fix this, fix his sword and then we will go to Redcliffe after that and it's end.
end game time. So, unless I get hijacked here. No, I, I don't. Uh, I'm gonna end the video here. Thank you for watching. And next time, Redcliffe. Bye.